Hello and welcome to more World War II 172 scale. Uh, today we're looking at a nice German vehicle, a self-propelled gun. Uh, this was known as the grill or the cricket. Sometimes it was also referenced to uh, a line of the called bison. Uh, it's got a big 150 millimeter gun on it and it's an open top chassis and it's built on the Panzer 38T uh, body and wheel system, also known uh, much later, uh, more famous for using for the Hetzer and the Martyr series. Uh, let's take a look at this one. This one is a a resin model with metal parts. The the trackway and wheels are metal, and I think some of the other parts were too. You can kind of see that uh, the cover there that they use for. Uh, putting up a tarp it's kind of bent I was happy with this paint job lots of uh, weathering and I've got uh, two crew I believe they were metal also you see the ones holding a shell and then on the other side they got another shell there very cramped inside not overly detailed uh, the model itself because like i said it's resin and metal so it's unlike a you know molded plastic model it doesn't always have quite the detail but it still looks good i have a few other of these that i built i think i did a video on a couple of the other ones this has some two crew in it and then it's got a nice unusual uh decal there a shield I believe I got a set of, uh, I don't know if it was Paddington House or one of the brands that make uh, decals for this scale for like Sturmgeschutz and that was close enough to put something a little bit unusual on there. And then there's the standard Balkan Cruise with a German cross on there. From the front. So uh, these would be used in groups of like five or six and supply, some provide artillery support and if it need to it could fire over open sights at a vehicle uh, with its big shell but it's mainly for HE from bombardment and attacking buildings and infantry and that kind of stuff so very nice uh, vehicle not like it and it's dark sand uncle gelb and it's green and then i have it on uh, one of my uh, display sloping little hill terrain pieces and then there's that background i have i need to get around to making more of them one day i will uh, for a diorama display and then for the side of edge of the war game board Till next time, thanks for liking, subscribing, and hitting that notification bell. More World War II, 172 scale to come. Thank you.